Most of us would feel safe in our own home, not expecting to become victims of a crime. But investigators say that might be the problem after crooks broke into several cars in a neighborhood near Round Rock. As KXAN's Lindsey Bramson explains, the crime did not take much because the doors were already unlocked. This video taken from a homeowner's surveillance camera in the Chandler Creek neighborhood shows a man walking up their driveway, then opening their car door in the middle of the night. We were leaving to go out and uh, we put the kids in the car and when we were putting them in the car we realized that everything was just thrown everywhere. So I knew at that point that my car had been broken into. Julie Ketchmar says she thought her car door was locked. In the video, you see the thief then try to get in her boyfriend's car, but walk away when he realized it wasn't open. You then see him open the door to the neighbor's truck. I'm hoping that they'll be able to catch him and put him in jail or, uh, you know, catch him or whoever else was involved. It's a wake-up call for many. Even in your own driveway, leaving your car unlocked just isn't safe. Last week, the same thing happened to some residents living in South Austin. Surveillance video shows another thief doing the same thing. Again, the car doors unlocked. We have two baby girls, so we want to have a nice, uh, safe neighborhood. And, uh, you know, just all the criminal element just have none of it. You just feel violated. Uh, I, didn't, I didn't even want to get in the car after that because it just, uh, you just don't know who's been in your car and you don't like it. The thief seemed to be after cash and other personal belongings. Lindsey Bramson, KXAN News. And the Williamson County Sheriff's Office is investigating several other car break-ins in that area. We wanted to see how Round Rock compares to its larger neighbor, Austin. Well, in the latest published data from 2012, Round Rock had 336 burglaries. That seems like a lot less than the number in Austin that year. It was 7,244 burglaries. But when you factor in population, Round Rock still has almost a third as many burglaries. Three cases for every thousand people versus nine in Austin. 